welcome back to another sorting video. If you guys really wanted to see some faster sorting, here we are. Back to the quick sort. If you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. All right, in quick sort, we'll choose the middle element as our pivot. Then we'll compare the two outer elements to the pivot. Uh, this dark blue screwdriver is now shorter <laughs> than the pivot, so it's in the wrong place. Uh, so now we'll check the other side. Um, the black screwdriver is also shorter than the yellow and black one, so it's in the right place. So we'll move in one and now check the pink screwdriver, uh, which is also shorter than the pivot. And then we'll move in another one to check the yellow and black screwdriver, which is also shorter than the pivot. So then we'll move in one to the pivot itself. Um, and the pivot is longer than the blue screwdriver, so we'll swap them. Now our counter will move in and we'll see that uh, this long blue screwdriver is longer than our pivot, so we'll swap those. And then our counters move in, and this yellow one is longer than the red and black one, so we'll switch it with the pivot. So now we know that our pivot is in the right place, so we can uh, separate this into two different sorted arrays. So now we move on to sort each of the um, separate arrays. So here, we will choose this middle element for our pivot, uh, and we start by comparing the edges again. The red and black screwdriver is longer than the um, yellow and black screwdriver, which is our pivot, so that we will leave that one there. The black screwdriver is also longer than the pivot, so it is in the wrong spot. We move, uh, because the red and black screwdriver was in the right spot, we move in one and see that the uh, blue screwdriver is shorter than the yellow and black pivot, so we want to switch it with the black screwdriver. Moving in one, we compare the pink and black screwdriver to the pivot uh, and see that the pink and black screwdriver is in the right spot, so we now have two halves of this array, and we know that our pivot was in the right spot. All right, so now let's check this subarray. Uh, this is of length one, so it's sorted. Um, we now check this other subarray. Uh, we choose the black one as the pivot, and we uh, compare the red and black one to the black one. The red and black one is longer, so it is in the right spot. So we now know that our pivot is in the right place. All right, and then in this subarray, we'll choose uh, the pink screwdriver as our pivot, uh, and then we'll compare it to the blue screwdriver, and we'll see that it is in the wrong place. So we'll switch them, and we now know that our pivot is in the right place. We now look at this remaining array um, and see that it is of length one, so it sorted. Um, and similarly with this subarray, it is also of length one, so it must also be sorted. So now, our array is completely sorted, using quicksort.